so a little bit of background. Uh, last night or yesterday, I was in Minneapolis, St. Paul for Secure 360. And then I was flying home and I didn't get into Rapid City until 2 a.m. Um, I slept a few hours and I knew that I had to write these slides. And this was really eating me. Like, you know, the theme of what this presentation should be is that simply having a security control does not invalidate the need for other controls. And this goes back to Marcus Ranum whenever he first developed the kind of the first heavily used firewall framework uh, years ago, when people finally got firewalls in their environments, they took that to mean that they didn't have to reduce ports. They took that to mean that they no longer had to patch their systems. They took that to mean that they no longer had to use strong passwords because we can put everything behind a firewall. And that simple mistake that happened like almost two decades ago uh, with uh, maybe even a little bit longer, I can't remember when Random released his firewall framework, uh, that one mistake in the way that people thought about computer security still has repercussions to this day because everybody gave up on trying to secure the inside of their environment because they had a firewall that was protecting them on the outside. So when we get on the inside of the network, it's basically like a candy shop that's completely wide open and no one's watching the till. You can do whatever you want. You can steal whatever you want if you were so inclined to be such a criminal, but we don't do that, right? Um, but this all is from a mistake of people looking at firewalls and learning the wrong lesson about what a firewall provides to them. Now we tie this back into two factor as far as the theme, two factor authentication. We use two factor authentication. We can reduce the password complexity. We can reduce our security controls because we have another security control and that's absolute garbage. So the same types of protections that you have put on the outside of your network should also be the same types of controls that you would run on the inside of your network. Just like you said earlier, treat the internal network as hostile because it is. You should have intrusion detection. You should have segmentation between VLANs. You should have host-based firewalls running in your environment. We have not learned this lesson. And for the record, Marcus Ranum almost immediately after he kind of came out with this firewall framework, immediately came out and said, y'all are doing it wrong. This isn't the way that I meant for this to be used. And unfortunately, very few people listen at all.